Uh, this is After School Children Manipulation uh, Pick Up White Powder Bags. Uh, they're they're clearly waiting uh, for the Candyman basement apartment. This is a very young child. As you can see. This is a victim. This is a victim. Uh, this address is 5130 West 24th Street, Laramie, Cicero, Illinois, 60804. Open for business, expansion in the works. Town of Cicero Police Department refuses to open up an investigation. Uh, there's children involved. After school children manipulation uh, to deliver and pick up white powder bags. And uh, the guy with the green shirt, he's the mule. And uh, fake jaw front. Fake jaw front. This is a child. <clears throat> and uh, let's see here. Here we go. This is a video. Do you know where your chi children are? This is a victim, after school children manipulation. Again, this address is 5130 West 24th Street, Laramie, Cicero, Illinois, 60804. Uh, let's see. Okay. Nose check, nose check. There you go. Nose check again. Organized crime family has no shame. This is a child. After school manipulation continues. This address is 5130 West 24th Street in Laramie. Cicero, Illinois, 60804. Open for business. And they're waiting for the candy man. See? The young child is uh, yawning. This is drug activity. And it's involving children after school. This is the reason Town of Cicero Police Department daily plan attacks, order of protection, joint collaboration with homeowner Martinez, wife, daughter, son, daughter-in-law, trying to create family conflict among my family. Order of protection. This is the reason for the daily plan attacks, bright light harassment, Electronic harassment. After school children, manipulation continues. There's just a yawn. That's a yawn.
Nose check. Nose check. Nose check. These government agencies uh, need to wake up. And uh, State Representative Lisa Hernandez, Congressman Chuy Garcia, uh, they're sleeping on the job. They're sleeping on the job. And that this is our tax money down the toilet. I provide a public service, and I'm being harassed on a daily basis by Town of Cicero Police Department. Order of Protection, joint collaboration with homeowner Martinez, wife, daughter, son, daughter-in-law, daily plan attacks, order of protection, trying to manipulate my ex-wife and my family, create family conflict concern, dial 911. This is a young child at the school. Look at that. Nose check. Nose check. Open for business. Expansion in the works. This is a public service. Please do your part. Contact your state representative, Lisa Hernandez, Congressman Chuy Garcia, the DEA, Drug Enforcement Administration, Chicago and Dearborn, Illinois, Child Protective Services, the news media, Department of Sexual Harassment, This uh, criminal organization um, is attacking my YouTube channel on video. Uh, they're stealing my phones right from my kitchen table. And Tana Cicero Police Department refuses to open up an investigation on my daily harassment. They're involved in this criminal organization. Some of them, not all of them. And... Um, On the videos that we have shown before, they're waiting, usually outside, um, once they attack me inside a public store. We have the videos. They're waiting for the candy man that lives in the basement. And that's... um. Where the little uh, child goes with his bike and delivers the white powder bags way on inside his book bag. And this is late at night. Nose check. Nose check again. San Francisco Police Department made a fake home visit a third time around, and they're going to have to make another one. Another fake home visit to avoid these government agencies from investigating. The murder plot continues on my life. Daily electronic harassment frequencies equivalent to an x-ray machine or microwave oven Exposure, radiation, over time. Same as um, sleeping next to a high power line. Uh, side effects, health. Side effects, tumor, cancer, brain damage. Silent incoherent victims, nursing home final faith, identity theft, Medicaid takes place. Unsolved murder cases of identity theft, Medicaid, victims are preconditioned, coerced, manipulated to react. Okay, and let's uh, <clears throat> let's check right quick. When they first uh, come out the, the vehicle, let's see. That's a very, very young child 
involved in drug activity. Organized crime family has no shame. Has no shame. To avoid suspicion, they're utilizing children after school. He's covering up his face. This is the reason I'm a target, folks. This is the reason. We're going to continue ex uh, exposing this criminal organization. Uh, today is November 3rd, 2024, Sunday. And uh, let me check what time is it. It's 2.50 p.m. 2.50 p.m. And I'm in my room because I'm being attacked electronically while watching TV. That's right, folks. Electronically. I have to lower the volume of the TV. And um, I'm being harassed next door with bright light harassment as well. And um, we heard some community gang stalking in the earlier. So this is daily plan attacks. And this is the reason for the order of protection right here. Uh, stop recording, uploading videos of 5130 and 5132. After school children manipulation continues. And this is a close up of the young child. These government agencies are continue contacting them. No response. No response. And my uh, YouTube channel is being attacked on a daily basis. This is a high-tech surveillance monitor that can transmit and transfer uh, electrical current, frequencies, and magnetic fields from any power uh, outage. Can shut down any power source. It is posted as a national security threat. This is an insurance fraud. Manipulate businesses. Remain in control. Silent victims. Organized crime family process. This is the reason uh, this criminal organization feels so confident that they can involve children with no consequences. Uh, no one is above the law. And um, they think Tana Cicero Police Department is enough they're going to have to make another fake home visit that we have on video. And there's an uh, order of protection in the works. Uh, as far as uh, my continued surveillance, evidence, public service. That's right, folks. I'm providing the public service. My objective is to make the community a safe one. And I'm being harassed on a daily basis by Tanisus Road Police Department. Daily plan attacks, joint collaboration, homeowner Martinez, wife, daughter, son, daughter-in-law. Next door, murder plot continues, daily electronic harassment frequencies coming from next door, 5135, second floor hideout. Anthony J. Loader, public enemy number one, you do not see him around, but we uploaded the video of him coming in and out of this uh, address right here, 5130 and 5132. West 24th Street in Laramie, Cicero, Illinois, 60804. Um, I urge the public, I need your assistance. Uh, I cannot do this on my own. Uh, my YouTube channel is under attack. I just brought two new phones. Um, I have a limited income. I cannot afford this. I'm trying to provide a public service. I'm reaching out to everyone. But uh, so far, no luck. And I've been doing this for quite some time. So I need the public uh, to contact the DEA, Drug Enforcement Administration, Chicago and Dearborn, Illinois, Child Protective Services, Department of Sexual Harassment, uh, the news media, 
Uh, State Representative Lisa Hernandez, Congressman Chuy Garcia, uh, they seem to think that there's no corruption, no cover-up going on in San Francisco. Um, I just visited uh, Belmont and Western Police Station. They're in charge of investigations, and uh, they're reviewing a lot of cases, unsub cases, uh, regarding identity theft Medicaid. I am a victim. I have a CT scan of bleeding from my brain from daily electronic harassment frequencies. And uh, organized crime family panicked and moved out from 5132 uh, West 24th Street in Laramie, Cicero, Illinois, 60804 to avoid any investigation by the IRS. They just moved in a month ago uh, to the second floor, new tenants. The first floor remains vacant. They're very hopeful they can get rid of me. Good luck with that. Uh, the basement is occupied by a young couple uh, with an infant child and a Doberman Pinscher dog. Uh, they're in charge of this property and they're involved in criminal activity regarding the little baby ride along. And we have them on video. And they're constantly working uh, to avoid the camera. Instructions given on command signal. Very aware of my location and activities. Again, this is posted as a national security threat and the urgency is more than before because we have credible evidence of after-school children being manipulated to deliver and pick up white powder bags. And there's drug use being um, manipulated here Organized crime family has no shame. My family has no idea. I'm trying to protect them. And um, so far, I'm working around as far as the bright light harassment uh, by moving the plants around. And um, But they are using truck lights with a dimmer switch. Uh, we have them on video. This is daily plan attacks. And this is the reason why. Uh, we are focusing at 5130 and 5132. Open for business, expansion in the works. Okay, <clears throat> this is what's going on. And uh, let's see. Well, We'll see if there's any more activity here. Uh, but uh, this is where the video took place at late at night. Uh, 5130 and 5132. And um, now they're hiding their vehicle. This is the vehicle right here that he was using that night with the child. Right there. That's the vehicle right there. And he's hiding. People hide for a reason, folks. He's hiding that vehicle. Let's take a closer look so you can see. He's hiding that vehicle because he's clearly involved in manipulation of children. And he's being protected. He's being protected. There we go. That's his license place right there. And that's where the child was at. Inside that vehicle. Hiding from camera view. See? Hiding from camera view. He was in the driveway earlier, but he was instructed to park there. Right there. And... Oh, there's a candy man over there. The candy man is hiding from the camera as well. So the candy man's hiding. See? That's the red Pontiac right there. And the mule, organized crime family employee, labeled the mule is hiding right there. Okay. And that's them right there. Open for business. And that's the reason I'm a target, folks. Okay. That's what's going on.
Heidi. People hide for a reason, folks. This is criminal activity on a daily basis involving children after school. And the harassment continues. There you go. Right there. Intentions are very, very clear. Daily plan attacks, harassment, and uh, I cope with this by removing the plants around. See the plants? I use the plants to avoid uh, the manipulating me to cover up the windows. I just covered up the a little bit up there. But this is how I avoid family conflict. This is how I avoid family conflict. You see that? They're very discreet. How they attack their victims. Victims are being followed home. Directly from their work. They're being studied. They're being manipulated. And shortly after, daily plan attacks and manipulate family conflict concern. Withdraw. Very important process. Okay, we are moving on and we have evidence regarding after school children. And this is very serious, folks. This is uh, the urgency is more than before. I'm asking for the public support. My phone number is 708. 708- 359-4551, text me. My address is 5133 West 24th Street in Laramie, Cicero, Illinois, 60804, second floor. And um, I'm trying to provide a public service, but I continue to be uh, attacked. My YouTube channel is under attack. They shut it down for... Uh, as far as my, my phones, disabling my phones from uploading videos. And I just brought two new phones. I have a limited income. I cannot afford this. And they're constantly stealing my phone right from my kitchen table while taking a shower. That's how defiant they are that they can get away with this. Town Central Police Department says I can use this for insurance, but they refuse to open up an investigation. UPS is still investigating. And, uh, well, the order of protection continues and the daily plan attacks as well. My family has no idea. And uh, keep your eyes on me, folks. Um, My uh, murder plot will not be in vain. This will open up a case. This murder plot is real, folks. This is manipulation. This is insurance fraud. This is unsolved murder cases of identity theft Medicaid. I provide the missing link. I provide a public service. Community gang stalking, as always, interrupting me while I'm speaking. Organized crime family is responding. They are responding. High frequencies. Uh, The furnace heater just turned on. High frequencies. Very high. And they just shocked my brain uh, from any electrical source outage uh, search. Uh, High-tech surveillance monitor can transmit and transfer electrical current to a patient or victim's brain. It's used for manipulation purposes. Uh, provoke movement reaction response, yelling, running out of control, kicking, screaming, public outbursts. That's why Town of Cicero Police Department, Sergeant Porter, badge number 2255, right forearm tattoo, was waiting, standing by, set up traps, false police reports, court dates, arrests. That's correct, folks, arrests. Right outside, Sir Mac Produce, while shopping, and all these. We have him on video, and uh, he made a fast getaway once I started recording him. 
And that's not the first time we have certain town of Cicero police officers that are involved in criminal activity, corruption, cover-up, daily plan attacks continue. And we also have grandma taking a walk, walking around the corner. And you guessed it, town of Cicero police department was waiting for me right around the corner. Okay, we're moving on. And uh, we are focused. It's um, November 3rd, 2024, Sunday, and it's um, 3.04 p.m. The pressure is on. We are focused. 5130 and 5134. Pressure is on. While in the bathroom, and we all know their intentions are very, very clear. Okay, moving on. 